me, it wasn't a, it wasn't a very long summer. It was I only had about six weeks, so I mean, uh, just tried to stay in shape and and also but also get some rest. You know, it was a long season, so uh, but I'm feeling good and ready to go. You know, we had a great year in Valencia, and I was thinking maybe I was going to go back there, but um, came clear. You know, they didn't want to resign me, and and Imar came with a great offer, and again, I I knew Imar and. Uh, Aito and, and Carlos and a bunch of the you know people with the club and I've been to Berlin before and was really excited about the opportunity to play in the German league and um, you know just try and help out this club and uh, obviously it's a you know a really important club in Germany and I was excited to be a part of it. Can you tell us about your new coach already? Um, you know I, I just played against him. I haven't played for him yet, but. Um, you know, he really just improves uh, players and his team's always, um, you know, hit their stride towards the end of the season, which is, you know, the most import important part. And uh, he really cares about um, individual development and the team improving. And, um, uh, you know, I'm excited to, to play for him. Well, I got in uh, yesterday morning, uh, late morning, and got to the apartment. It's a great apartment. Um, kind of got settled in, unpacked some things. Um, then took a long nap because I was a little jet lagged. But um, woke up and just kind of you know checked out the city, drove into downtown, found a good place to eat, some dinner, and uh, just kind of drove around the town. I wanted to see what the city was like. You know, you hear so much about it, and there's so much excitement about coming here that. Uh, I really just wanted to kind of drive around and get a feel for it. So that was what I was doing uh, yesterday and today. has just kind of been a bunch of medical tests and things like that, just kind of getting ready for the season. Uh, yesterday I brought my dog. So it's just me and my little dog, Elena. Um, but my wife will be following us with an, our other dog uh, in September. And she'll be here for the whole year. What kind of dogs are those? Uh, one is just a little small dog. She's a mixed breed um, that we got in Lithuania. And then uh, we just got another one, a miniature husky. He's just a pup. He's just about five months old, but uh, he's a small dog, but he's a good-looking dog. Oh, I'm really excited for the season. I think it's going to be – I think we got a group of guys that are uh, – winners that are guys that want to come in and, and make a statement and uh, also got a great coach that's I think can take us there to, to the next level um, obviously got to take it step by step but I think it's going to be a very successful season well um, on the flight over here from Boston there was a medical emergency so I was actually taking a nap on the plane and I looked up at the little flight tracker and I just saw a big u-turn and I knew it was trouble so I ended up Staying the night in Turkey last night after missing my connection and a couple more lines I had to wait in and I ended up getting a Turkish visa um, bucket list <laughs> and uh, I stayed in a hotel late last night in Turkey. I feel really good. I mean, I'm all obviously tired from the travel, but this this city has a really good feel to it. I've, I've seen a lot of people, I've made, met a lot of good people and uh, I think the best part about me is I like being on a team, you know, I like I like getting along with people. so. I think I'm an easy guy to get along with on and off the court, so I think that could really help out the team. And then from a physical standpoint, just being a seven-footer that's you know a good presence on defense and kind of being smart on offense, not, you know, not making mistakes and being a guy that can pass the ball, create opportunities for other people.